Hello Fire Signs, Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius. Welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. I do your reading almost daily and I upload your videos right away so these messages are current. For those of you dealing with someone who is hot and cold or has gone silent, we're going to find out why. And this question was submitted by a few of my subscribers, Jem, Finley, Kate, and Sarawat. So here we go. We're going to get your reading started. And also please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it's not going to apply to each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me. Why has Leo Aries and Sagittarius person gone silent or acting hot and cold? A lot of um, cards here that for me indicates them right now your person is either your person home is acting hot and cold or silence because they're not feeling it right now. The King of Cups here is in reverse. They're very over overwhelmed with a lot of things. I feel like because cups can indicate emotions. So emotionally, they may be unstable or unavailable. They may be feeling kind of desensitized or they could be numbing themselves as well as in like just don't want to feel right five of swords here is in reverse and we've got the hangman and the page of pentacles here but it feels like your person is going to reach out eventually uh it feels like they need to recover from something as well five pentacles here is in reverse a lot of these pentacles are in reverse they may be either um trying to they could be working really hard or trying to build something for themselves um but also they could be going through some issues or they may be far away another thing i know this is very specific it's not going to apply to all of you each and every one of you you just take what resonates with you if you have a person who travels a lot or they're not at home because ten of pentacles and reverse can indicate that they're not at home they're traveling they may be at a place where it's a little bit hard to um call a message um, maybe the Wi-Fi is weak, but <laughs> that's just for some of you only, okay? I'm going to tell you this. If, if somebody wants to get in touch with you, they will get in touch with you by hook or by crook. They can buy another phone. They can borrow a phone from somebody. <laughs> they will do anything, anything, okay, to get in touch with you. If somebody wants to get in touch with you by hook or by crook, they will get in touch with you. So it's very, very rare, but it does happen. I mean, it has happened to me where I couldn't get in touch, you know, with somebody at one point because I, I really had no Wi-Fi or my phone was stolen or I lost my phone and everybody got so worried. Um, or just like the other night, I went out and my friend got so worried about me because I couldn't get an Uber to get back. And my friend was really drunk too. I mean, I rarely party uh, a lot. I mean, I party maybe once or twice a month, max. Um, but when I do, I go all out, right? So I have a lot, a lot of fun. <laughs> but the thing is, like, I, she said, you text me or call me when you when you get back. So one of the guys at the at the club actually sent me back. He's such a nice guy, French guy, right? He was so nice, and he sent me back. Um, and I forgot, I forgot to text her because I was drunk and, you know, even though I was drunk, I was like making food and I ate and I went to sleep and I completely forgot to. No, it could be that for some of you, small, small percentage of you, it could be that there's some cards that actually indicate that, but not for all of you, because I always believe this. If somebody wants to get in touch with you, they will by hook or by crook, unless they are too drunk or something something has happened, like the phone is missing or no Wi-Fi, no way to get to somebody, but they will get in touch with you as soon as they can. First thing, right? But anyway, for most of you, fire signs, Leo, Aries, and such, I feel like your person is just at this point where they're, if they're, acting hot and cold or has gone silent is because they it has a sense of giving up not to say it like giving up on you or it's just a sense of them not wanting to deal right now don't want to deal because five of swords here and one first it's like 
I don't want to deal with this right now. I'm I don't know how to how I'm feeling with the King of Cups in reverse. Could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Could be for Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. But I feel like eventually they are gonna reach out because the Page of Pentacles is right here, so they will reach out. Um, eventually, um, the Death card here is in reverse. Feels like they they're trying to like. They just need some time to be alone. It feels like they need to um, slowly come back to life again <laughs> because it does look like it's kind of slow, right? But I'm feeling overwhelmed right here. And then maybe for some of you, both of you are going through some issues or could be separated, but yeah, it, it feels very slow. So they want to also, they, they need some time as well with the hangman here to see things in a different perspective. But perspective but i feel like your person is going to come around anyway eventually they're going to reach out to you um or they may be overwhelmed because of work right uh, pentacles king of pentacles here in lovers or they don't have again the resources or like a phone or something to reach out to you again that part is just for some of you not all of you and also the king of swords and then we've got the knight of swords and lovers these two cards definitely indicate no communication or very little communication um i feel like your person maybe really is needing time to think i feel like they could be thinking about what to say they're not taking any actions right now but they will they will communicate eventually but right now maybe they just they just don't know what to say because the swords are involved first they're unclear as in what to say or what to do they're feeling very unstable so you know pentacles indicate stability as well but they're feeling very unstable they're not sure and six of wands is right here it, there could also be something else that they're trying to achieve right now right maybe they're battling with something because the six of wands indicates a battle somebody has gone to a battle or war and then returns uh victoriously but i feel like this could be what they're going through right now they're, they could be battling something um maybe emotional something emotional or it could be because of money work or it could be just like my story earlier on <laughs> where someone maybe they lost their phone something i mean i know for sure that has happened to me so it's not impossible right we've got the nine of swords here and also we've got the justice in reverse your person is stressing out like they are um they just don't know what to do they've been losing sleep um they've been worrying a lot there could be something that they're worrying about again it could be work it could be because maybe both of you are going through some issues right now could be separated or you know maybe both of you had a fight as well because the not a sword's in reverse, not of sorts can be a bit of uh, an angry energy. Perhaps there's some anger as well. They may be angry and they may be also suppressing, trying to suppress their anger and don't really want to say anything right now. But I feel like they're going through a lot, especially emotionally. Um, but they're, they're battling at 601. So that means they want to get through it once they are, they've gone through all of this process. Maybe they're processing as well. Um, you know, because the swords are here in their head and emotionally as well. Justice here is in reverse. So something that is off balance. Again, if you look at the, what do you call the wing scale, it's in reverse. So they are kind of off balance. Something is not right. Again, it feels like it could be emotionally or that they could be keeping some anger deep down. Uh, or they could be going through depression or something that is just off that's what i'm getting here but they're again they're fighting it they're they're battling it and once they feel better i feel like they are going to reach out to you for pentacles and advice yeah then they are going to reach out to you eventually all right fire signs leo aries sagittarius this is your reading hope you resonated if you do please hit like share and subscribe i'm gonna leave you with my latest uh i'm gonna leave you with a playlist from my second travel vlog channel check it out if you want to and also i'll leave you with a another playlist it's for uh, it's it's in this channel it's for this channel oh another thing i've posted your korean finance reading today uh check it out if you want to that uh those readings um they were questions requested from some of my subscribers so but you know it's for everyone um 
check it out if you want to. And also, I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Take care. Bye.